Hey guys, Zinja here and today I'll be telling you how to play Widowmaker. Widowmaker is the sniper of Overwatch. She'll be looking over the longer ranges, picking off enemies and defending the objective. Widowmaker has all the necessary abilities a sniper would need. In sniper mode, she can fire repeated low damage shots or charge shots for a higher damage. When not zoomed in, in a sniper mode, her weapon is a fully automatic assault rifle which performs well in close quarters. When using her weapon in assault rifle mode, be sure to use it in close quarters against enemies who like to rush such as Genji or Tracer. The primary mode you will be using for Widowmaker's weapon will be the sniper mode since that's what her role is. While it may be tough to take out fast moving enemies such as Tracer, it isn't impossible. Enemies such as the Bastion in sentry mode make for easy targets since they do not move. A fully charged shot and a few rapid shots to follow up should take him out pretty easily. Zenyatta is an easy target for Widowmaker as well since Zenyatta doesn't really have any way to quickly get out of danger. Widowmaker has two abilities, the Venom Mind and the Grappling Hook. Grappling Hook is very useful for getting to high vantage points to get a bird's eye view of the objective making it easy to pick off enemies. The grappling hook is also very useful when you need to get out of a tight situation. It has a 12 second cooldown. The venom mine, when placed, is triggered when an enemy is in its vicinity. It releases poisonous gas, dealing damage to the foe over time, and can inflict damage on Widowmaker 2 if she's in the radius of the blast. I'd recommend placing this in a high traffic area, such as the objective or on your flank so that you can be alerted if someone is sneaking up from behind so that you can switch to your assault rifle mode and be ready to take them on. It has a 15 second cooldown and you can only place one mine at a time. Next up is her ultimate, that is the infra sight. It lasts for 15 seconds allowing you and your team to see enemies through walls. Due to Widowmaker's high damage, her ultimate will charge up very fast, allowing you to use it quite frequently. Use it as often as you can to provide support for your teammates and yourself. This works great in conjunction with heroes such as Junkrat since he can lob and bounce his grenades behind walls into rooms where the enemies are at. Farah can pre-fire her rockets at foes and Roadhog can better time his chain hook grapple his enemies and finish them off when they're turning corners. Widowmaker is a strong counter against Zenyatta. Due to his poor mobility and slower movement, Zenyatta is a prime target for Widowmaker since he also heals allies. Zenyatta's minimal health makes it easier for Widowmaker to take him out. The Bastion is also a very easy target for Widowmaker since when he's in sentry mode, he's pretty much stationary and can't move. A full power shot followed up by some rapid shots from Widowmaker's sniper should easily take out the Bastion. And lastly, Farah. Due to her flying around slowly with her jets, it makes it easy for Widowmaker to snipe her. Even when Farah is using her ultimate, it shouldn't be a problem for Widowmaker to grapple away and then snipe her since she's stationary when using her ultimate. And that's the guide for Widowmaker. This has been Zinja. Thanks for watching and goodbye. Play of the game.